Welcome to Two Minutes to Change. We're going to hear about Suzanne Maloney's heroes and her big idea. The project is called the Bialtina Project. She is pretty much everything I believe um, in, I'm freezing up again, um, in terms of spirituality, um, in terms of learning. Um, she's written a few books. Charles Doubting, Charles Doubting. Okay. Is the no dig a method of planting that is just layering? It's not a no dig. It's called no dig. Yeah. Um, and it's just layering on of compost year after year onto, he takes cardboard, lays it down. This is how a lot of my beds were done because it's all, it's all um, clay out there. Um, yeah. Yeah. Um, eight, eight to 10 inches of compost on top of it in rows and he plants in it and he just studies. And gosh, she, has been raising her own flowers and selling them um, for forever. And um, she's just so hilarious and so average, but so extraordinary. Oh, that's <laughs> and I was into that. I like I, the idea of somebody being absolutely normal and absolutely extraordinary. Yeah. <laughs> and what's Suzanne's one big idea? Um, I think that people have forgotten how to converse. I think that pe people have forgotten how to just be a community. Mm. My grandmother could tell the most wonderful stories, you know, and my grandfather who was a golf pro had amazing stories. And you don't hear people do that anymore. You don't hear someone telling another person a, a true story from right. beginning to end. And I think the loss of that um, has kind of um, caused a loss of personality to our culture. Oh, you know, so and well I, said. I think, and that's what this is about for me. Thanks for joining us for episode 40 with Suzanne Maloney. This has been Subject to Change, a sustainability podcast. Please like, subscribe, comment, and join us for another episode next week.